you don't. That's, That's all right. We understand. So, take, so we're not taking a picture. Right. No, we're doing the video. No, if, if don't play right. Angry Birds while you're taking a picture. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. I don't know if it's. Si if, I don't know if we're gonna. Okay. 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 We're already old pals around here. How you doing? Action Jackson here backstage at the Moondog Coronation Ball. And I'm with Danny and Corey. We chatted for a little while here and we were backstage talking about the last time they were here at the Moondog Coronation Ball and little Richard was here. Oh, Remember yeah, that? Yeah. Yes. Yeah, and he uh, shut things down on the stage. Yeah, uh, they were. Well, you know, close -ups. He, yeah. came, were. he came out, he was having hip operations that were coming up, and hopefully he's had, those are successful, Yeah. but he was in a wheelchair, and they had to bring him up, and he came out, and then he saw himself after two songs in the big, huge screens, and did not like what he saw, the makeup wise. Just a little. And he <laughs> shut the screens down, and Corey and I were... Our jaws dropped. It's like he became he said, Why did we do that? <laughs> <laughs> Just a little diva ish. I never thought of that. You know? A little diva ish. They respect you more. He's, you know? a, he's a boss. He headlined. He can do whatever he wants. That's right. And I hope he's doing well. King of Rock and Roll. He's doing better. He's doing yeah. better, I heard. So good, good, you guys you. have uh, done our show three times now. Yes, we have. You're three timers. So we, we like it here. Yeah. And well, that's we good. Do. That's good. And you, have you guys, I know, in the classic Three Dog Night days, did you play Cleveland a lot? Oh, yeah. Hello, Cleveland! <laughs> yeah, we've seen that movie. We, we played I've never all, heard that we played before. All, all 50 states uh, many, many times. All 50. Yeah, and there are 50 states. Right? There are 50, as far as I know. Add in anymore. If there you ask a politician, four. you may get, you know, 52 oh, occasionally. Oh, you know, they may. There was 48 when I was not in high school, so I get confused. No, no, no. It's 50. They haven't actually, added any. Actually, yet. we had a period where that's where we exclusively are in Ohio. We played every place in Ohio, really, including the Wild Goose. Yeah, yeah. Right. Chicago, Chicago, yeah. Wow. That, this whole area, this tri area. Wow. So tri -area. Now, it, it comes up with every act that comes in through town that's not in yet, because we're with the Rock Hall is here. Can I ask you? Well, you can ask you. Do, you, do you have an opinion about being in one way or the other? Uh, all, I, all I can tell you is that I don't mean it as a diss to any, any groups, but there's a lot of uh, people that have been inducted that open for us. I, yeah. I don't know what that tells you, but uh, <laughs> I think there's a vendetta. I, I had heard that there was an issue with with, with one of the members. I won't say who, but there was an issue going on. I'll argue with Corey that they're not even thinking about this. <laughs> there's, a, there's a little, there's, as far as I know, there's a little, there's a little network of X amount of guys, and the, then everybody gets to vote after they say you can vote. But, uh, for whatever reason, and that's, that's fine. I, you mentioned acts that opened for you and, and things like there are acts that had like maybe five or six hits songs that had they're considered legendary. You guys have had like 21, 22 big, big hits, yeah. song after song after song after song. Is there a secret to that, to being able to pick the right songs for you guys? Is there back a then, back then, uh, it seemed like we had the secret, but it was just all pixel taste. <laughs> <laughs> it Look, seems like it. If, if we knew the secret, we would now be. Uh, Oh, we'd be oh, we'd be like Motown, the head of Motown. We'd say, "Come here, kid. This is how you, you guys go. could have you been." You know, that's that's what's wonderful about rock and roll. It's all magic, timing and, and songs and serendipity and mistakes and that 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 song you put on the album. Everybody goes, "We need one more. We don't have one. We're, um, do that piece of crap that you're." Uh, and they do it in 15 minutes, and it sells. It's a big hit, yeah. Yeah, it's all wonderful in a way. It, that's it's that show thing. It seems that's, like that's the magic it was. It's yeah. No longer well, it seems like you guys really had that magic touch in terms of picking out people because they would all go on to become a lot of them. A lot of the songwriters, Bigger Leo us, Sayer yes. and Elton John. <laughs> I know you did John. one of his early songs, well, you know, and, John, and Nielsen and people like we, that. We, you know? yeah, w without you know. Uh, not kidding. We worked our ass. We worked very, very hard. Yeah. We, we worked very hard. So I don't know how we stayed up for days. But 
<laughs> really? They worked very hard. Yeah. But the, the, the writers, uh, they're unknown at the time, and so, but, but we didn't have a magic uh, crystal. That we didn't know that they were going to go on to be huge hits, but we picked quality stuff. And, and we liked it. Obviously, yeah. it uh, proved us in the pudding. One of your biggest songs is uh, Mama Told Me Not To Come, Randy Newman. He's getting uh, inducted you know, into the, into the rock hall, actually. So it's, uh, you know. Vestige. <laughs> I'm sorry, but it, that, that, oh, curb my chin. Okay. He, <laughs> no, he wanted hey, to say something love, else. I could talk. No, he's, no, he's yeah. a sweet, he's yeah. a, he's <laughs> super talented. Yeah. 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 But so are you guys, and you guys did an excellent set out there just a little while, and you guys, the thing that always gets me is how you guys keep your voices in such good shape. Any secret there? Uh, I don't know, I'm thinking uh, maybe, is there something that you plug in here? He's got the little band-aid on the no, side. No, I usually, I usually have two of them, one fell off. Oh, I see, okay. That's no. where the bar goes in there. Bolts? No, Bolts. no, I, I went, I went and I tell everybody, go to your dermatologist. When in doubt, I always go when I have, I'm Irish, I have a little freckle. And I went, did it, he took a nice little chunk out, and he went, oh, you're fine. <laughs> oh, thank you very much. So I wear a band-aid for my, but I'm telling you, I didn't have to take that out. When in doubt, when in doubt out there, go see your dermatologist. There you go. A dermatologist is a man's best friend. And woman's best friend too. Absolutely. I think that's the perfect way to end the interview. I had no idea it was going there. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, well, two of the members, founding members of Three Dog Night, right here. And you were going to say? I just want to give you a little skin. Gotcha. All right. I gotcha. Again, the old dermatologist joke. They tell that at every convention. I, know that. I like your shoes. Thank you very much. Like sure. Little skin no, down there too. Yeah. Oh, all right, down there. Gator skin. Nice. <laughs> See, we're done now. That's it. <laughs> so, Danny and Corey, thank you very much, right, and we'll have you back a fourth time, I'm sure, at some point. Thank you, Mr. Thank you very much. Action backstage at the Moon Dog.